Hey everyone, this is Scott from Express, and today we are going to learn how to create a one page navigation menu using your WP Floating Menu Pro. So to do this, I'll go to my WP Floating Menu and add a new menu. I want this to be called one page menu example and I'm going to add the menu. So for this, we'll need a page containing different sections. So I have created just a page for you. So you can see that the menu from my previous video is here. We're just going to ignore it for now. But here, we can see that I have different sections, about four sections. And all the sections have its individual div ID, which we are going to use to create a one-page navigation menu. So to do this, I'm just going to right click, inspect and check out my div ID for this. This is div1, so I'm just going to copy it, go to my menu, create a custom link and put a hash to represent an ID and paste the ID over here. And I'm going to call this home and I'm going to add this to the menu. Similarly, the second section I have has the ID of div2 so I'm going to copy this paste it and call it about and add to the menu the next one we have is our service section so I'm just going to right click it copy the div ID go back to my menu put a hash paste and call it service and add to the menu similarly the next section i have is a contact us so i'm just going to right click select the div id copy it put a hash paste the div id and call it contact and add to the menu so i'm going to go to my home copy this paste it paste it so to the and I'm going to select an icon home for this and I want to use the default color for the about I'm going to copy this paste it paste it so to the and let's say select an icon similarly for service copy it paste it paste it so to the title select icon For my contact, just gonna copy this, paste it, paste it. So tooltip, select icon. I'm gonna choose an envelope, which is here, and gonna save this menu settings. So in my display settings, for this, I'm gonna choose one of the horizontal uh, menus we have, and I want it to be in the bottom center. And I'll save the settings. Now, since I want this menu to be just in this particular page, I'm going to go to this page. So I have this floating menu option here and I'm going to choose the one page menu example that we have just created and I'm going to update the page. So if I view the page and you can see that my previous menu has been overwritten and my menu works just fine. So that is how we create a one-page navigation menu using the WP uh, Floating Menu Pro. Thank you.